so today I'm back with a new haul video for you guys. I'm not too sure if you guys still like these videos. Let me know by either liking this video or tell me in the comments if you still enjoy these haul videos. I love watching them, but I don't know if you guys still enjoy them. This is like my favourite video to film though, so I hope you do. So as a lot of you guys know, I'm going to New York in December, which is literally crazy literally incredible I am so excited and obviously I needed to get some warm comfy cute clothes because the whole reason I'm going there is for work and to film so I'm so excited to show you guys some of the stuff that I got all the things that I got are from either ASOS or TK Maxx or Primark so I hope you enjoy it's all very affordable I am actually gonna start with these stuff from the shops other than Primark first because I got a lot of stuff from Primark. So the first thing I got is this bag which I think is so so pretty. I've never had a bag this colour before. It's like a dusky pink colour. It's really pretty. I really like it. And I wanted to get a bag that isn't too big because I always end up carrying such like big bulky things. And this has a nice long strap. If I can pull it. It's very stiff. It's got a strap so you can have it like on your shoulder and it like dangle down. It has really pretty gold detailing and inside it's only got one pocket I'm pretty sure. I haven't even taken the tissue out yet. So inside it's just kind of like a silky kind of feel. It's got like one of those mini pockets for your phone and then a zipper across the back. And it's not too big and it's not too small. I feel like it's just the perfect size to like carry around my vlog camera, my purse, my phone chargers, SD cards, and that's pretty much all I need, so I love it, it's really cute. The next thing I got, I got this because the person I was shopping with said it looked really good on me, so I decided why not, just yanking the tags off, and this was from River Island, it was on sale for £10, it was in the men's section, but you know, it's hat. I never think that hats suit me, but hold up, let me show you how I did my hair. So I had it on like this. I think it looks okay. This seriously affects my hearing though. Like I literally, I can't hear anything when I'm wearing this. I don't know why, but I think it's really pretty and it keeps my head so toasty. And that's gonna be perfect for New York. It's gonna be freezing while we're there. Next thing I got are these gloves, which match the bag. And they are like suede, fake suede obviously. Like they're just so nice and so warm. And they're so cute as well. I think they're really like classy gloves. I know. I feel like a princess would wear them or something. And they are so, so warm. I was worried because I've got acrylic nails that they wouldn't fit in the gloves. I thought it looked really creepy. I mean, they kind of do look really pointy at the top, but it's all good. They're all warm and cozy and I love them. Sticking with that pink theme, I decided to get a pink scarf to match the bag and the gloves. Because I'm that person, you know? So I got this light pink scarf, it's so, so nice. It's a little bit off from the gloves and the bag. I mean, none of them completely match, but they match enough for it to be like, oh, look, she coordinated. But I love this. It is so thick. It is so cozy. What is this material? It literally feels incredible. Is there a label on you anywhere? It's got little tassels at the bottom and it's so big and long and huge and nice and I am just so excited to wear this because look how big and cozy. I'm going to be so warm with my hat and my gloves and my big coat and I can't wait. It's just so so nice and this is the ASOS own brand as well so it wasn't expensive. I think it was about £12. Next few things I also got from ASOS and I'm going to start with these jeans. I'm never the kind of person that spends a lot of money on clothes. I always feel like I don't know, in the past I've spent like £50 on jeans, I've spent £10 on jeans and the quality, there wasn't much difference in it. Like if you go to Topshop and buy some black jeans, they'll go grey after like six washes which I think is so ridiculous because they're pretty expensive. And then you can get jeans from ASOS for like £20 and the black stays the entire time you have them. And I just, I don't know, things are weird. But I decided to get these jeans from Blank NYC pretty fitting and they were on ASOS and I saw them and I really like the colour of them they're like a really dark blue they look huge when they're off but they fit me perfectly when I opened them I was like oh my god they're gonna be so big 
but they fit really well. These were £60 and I never ever ever spend that much money on jeans but I looked at them and I was like you know what if they're not up to the standard that I want I'm going to send them back because ASOS has free returns. So I got them and I just absolutely fell in love with them. I tried them on this morning as soon as I got them and they look amazing. They don't squash you anywhere so if you've got like not the biggest butt whenever I put jeans on I always flatten it and I'm just like no I'm trying to do the opposite. These made my butt look perfect like it looks the same as it does when I'm wearing leggings and my butt looks pretty good when I'm wearing leggings if you're wondering why I'm not trying anything on in this video it's because all of this stuff is going to a lookbook that I'm going to be filming while I'm in New York but I just want to show you guys because I'm so excited also you can kind of see a few bits that I'm going to be filming in and kind of get a little bit excited for the video because I've got some really cool pieces I also grabbed a pair of tights from ASOS 40 denier kind of thick Ooh, not that thick but I needed tights and these look pretty Pretty. This next thing I got, I absolutely love the colour. It kind of looks suede because of the colour. I don't know why it does that, but it really does look kind of suede. It is this kind of, it's not that much of a deep V, but it is a V-neck. It's not loose as well, it's a tight bodysuit, long sleeve, it's got like the thong thing so you don't get um, underwear lines, because I hate when you wear a bodysuit and you've got massive underwear lines. You're like you're wearing like your nan's underwear, but I love this color. It's so pretty. It's like a dusky pink, but quite dark. I just wait. It's mauve. It's mauve. That's what color it is, and I just love this. How much was it? Fourteen pounds, maybe. It's the ASOS own brand as well. I just, I love this. I love the quality of their bodysuits. They're amazing, and I needed a long sleeve one because obviously it's gonna be pretty cold. And I just thought this was so pretty, and it's gonna look so good. So everything else I have to show you guys is from Primark. So I'm gonna dive into that now. It's all on my lap. So the first thing I got is this skirt. Now Primark sizes are so so weird. I'm usually like an eight, sometimes a ten in other shops very rarely a 10 because i've lost a little bit of weight but sometimes i am in primark i'm either a six or a four which is a huge huge difference but i've bought so many clothes in a size eight from primark and they were just like hanging off me and look ridiculous i don't understand why i'm such a small size but oh well just a note if you're going to primark so i got this one in a size six and it was four pounds four pounds and it's just a really pretty, like, thick, knitted bodycon skirt. And I got one in an 8 before, and it was in my autumn lookbook. You know the black and white one? Similar print to this. I think it might be exactly the same, but black and white. And it was too big on me. You might be able to tell it kind of, like, bunches off on the sides. This is going to fit perfectly. I'm so excited to wear it because that other skirt is so, so warm because of the thick material. And I think it's going to look so pretty with some tights, that hat, and then, like, a nice black turtleneck would look really good I can't wait to wear this I am so excited I also got some of their these are branded as super cozy socks because they're not fluffy socks they're like a mix between fluffy socks and normal socks as you can see they're fluffy they're cozy but most fluffy socks are really thick and these you can wear with like shoes and they're not bulky and they don't make your shoes feel uncomfortable and I love these and I thought, you know what, warm socks is a necessity because my feet are freezing 24-7. Like no matter what shoes I'm wearing, my feet are always cold so I needed some big, nice cozy socks. Next thing I got, I'm not entirely sure about but I think it would look good because it's like a wintry, Christmassy lookbook. I thought this would be really cute. So I got this kind of sea green. It kind of looks silver on the camera but it's definitely more of a greeny blacky bluey colour. It's definitely like a sea green and it's um, velvet, crushed velvet and I just absolutely love this. It's long sleeve but it is cropped so obviously like I think this would just look good with like black jeans and my coat and boots but I just I love this. I think it's such a nice piece. I think it's so wintry, so Christmassy and I think it's gonna look really cute in the video and it's got like a little turtleneck as well here. It's like a little tiny roll neck so it goes up a little bit which kind of keep my neck warm as well, which is a bonus. I also got some pyjamas from Primark because I didn't have any warm, cosy pyjamas and obviously in New York's going to be cold. So I got these big, like, well they're not big actually, they're pretty tight. They're like fleecy, like tartan pyjamas and they are so, so warm and so soft. And they're tapered at the leg as well. So they're kind of like leggings but a little bit looser. Like if you've got leggings in two sizes up, 
that's the fit that they've got and I just love these it's got like a stretchy waistband as well and they're so nice and warm I also got a little vest top to go with that and this is the one that's got like the boob support thing not that I need it because it's not like I got huge boobs or anything but it's nice so you don't have to wear a bra and this is only £2.50 can you believe that £2.50 how did the how I don't get it. This next piece you guys might recognise from a previous video. I got this skirt in a size 8 in my last Primark haul and it was way too big for me so I decided to get it in a 6 because I loved it so much and I gave the other one to my little sister because she's a little bit bigger than me. The last kind of clothing item I got from Primark is this dress which I thought was so pretty. It is like this dusky kind of pink mauvey pink it kind of matches my lipstick doesn't it it's got three quarter length sleeve it's got like a little keyhole thing in the back and i just absolutely love this with this obviously it's going to be a little bit cold so my plan is to wear like a bodycon like dress underneath it to keep me warm and then obviously tights and my coat and boots and all that jazz but i just thought it was so pretty it's kind of like waffle material and i just love this dress i couldn't pass on it i got it in a size six because it looks like it's meant to be loose fitting but i wanted it to be a little bit tighter so i got this i was just about to guess how much this was but the price label is no longer on it but probably eight pounds i'm gonna say eight pounds for this one now the last thing that i have to show you guys are both shoes i needed some shoes for the video and one of the pairs i wanted to get i wanted them to be really statement in your face like oh my god what are you wearing shoes because I feel like if you get shoes like that they can either look amazing or they can look really tacky and either way I think they look really good <laughs> so I decided you, you should probably sit down for this I got these I got these they are like rose gold metallic shiny boots and I actually love these these were 12 pounds 12 pounds and honestly I'm probably only gonna wear them for the video but it's New York I needed something out of the box something crazy and I want one of the outfits to just be like full-on oh my god that's insane like push boundaries because I feel like a lot of my outfits in lookbooks are very similar and kind of repetitive and for this one I've got something super special planned and I cannot wait to wear these and I've also been looking for like a suede kind of pair of shoes and I got these blue suede shoes like Elvis is sung and it's got the gold trim around the heel which I think is such a nice little detail and I just think these are really really pretty um I don't know what the quality is going to be like but they feel pretty sturdy and I'm really excited to wear them and these were 15 pounds so you can't really complain even if the quality isn't amazing even if they last me just for the trip it's going to be great so that is everything i have to show you guys thank you so much for watching this video i am so excited to film this new york lookbook i am literally like i'm like so excited inside but yeah you guys are gonna love it i'm gonna work so hard on it and i just can't wait to go and film the video so i hope you guys liked everything that i got i'm sorry this wasn't a try on haul but it would kind of ruin the lookbook if I tried these things on. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for watching this video. And also, if you like these paintings behind me, in Tuesday's video, I'm going to be showing you where I got them from. And I've got so many pictures on my wall now. It looks so pretty. But yeah, I'm rambling, so I'm just going to go. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and maybe subscribe if you liked it. I'll see you on Tuesday with a new video. Bye!